So this video will demonstrate how to complete an assignment that has a OneDrive document uh, attached to it. So the first thing I'm going to do is click on the assignment. And then you get a screen that looks like this. Um, and so it tells you the name of the assignment, the description, the due date, um, that kind of thing. And then I'm going to go over here and click on my document. And you'll have to bear with me. My computer is a little temperamental. Um, so when you click on that, my document, you'll see, okay, here is a, um, what the document looks like. Um, I'm not ready to submit anything yet because I haven't done anything to this document, but you can see that there are places where I could type something in. So I'm going to go over here and click on edit and then notice it opened up a new tab in my browser and it brings me to my own OneDrive um, account. And so you can see here's my student name up here with the name of the assignment. Um, and so that helps uh, me to know that it's my assignment and who uh, or in what assignment it is. And then I can see my teacher's name over here and then the name of the assignment. So then I can go in and I can um, start typing into the document. And again, my computer is a little bit slow, so bear with me. So I can say, so I can enter in some answers and then I'm going to let make sure I let it save. So it's still saving. So now it says saved. So I'm going to go back over to Schoology and I'm going to refresh my screen. So that way, hopefully it will upload what I already completed in the OneDrive document. Um, and I can see, okay, there's nothing there yet. So it has not updated yet. Sometimes these things take a, a minute or two. Depends on the Wi-Fi connection sometimes. So I'm going to go ahead and refresh my screen again to see if it will update the answers that I put into the document. And there I can see that it did put in my answers. So now I think that I'm done with my assignment. So I'm going to go ahead and click uh, the submit. Now I could go back to my assignment over in OneDrive if I wanted to, and I could type some more. So I could type some more, and then again, I'm going to wait for it to finish saving um, my work. Now, if you were to open this up in the desktop app, um, you would need to make sure that you synced it with your OneDrive first uh, before you check back into Schoology. Um, so now I'm going to refresh my screen in Schoology again to see if it updated my assignment. And yes, it did, because it says there are seven people there. So now I'm ready to submit. And so I'm going to go ahead and click on that submit button as soon as my computer is done thinking. So I click submit. Um, and this time I am pretty confident that I did everything that I needed to do. So I'm going to hit yes, submit. If I was having second thoughts and thought maybe I needed to add something else, I could go to ne never mind, not yet, and then continue to edit the assignment. All right, so then, yay, I'm done. So then what um, you'll notice is if you go back to your OneDrive, you'll have a folder in OneDrive um, that's titled like Schoology um, Assignments and um, then I still have access to my document, but now it has been submitted. So that way my teacher can grade it. Um, so that is how you submit your assignment using a OneDrive document that is attached to an assignment.